Let's now configure the QBag portal for interfacing with the Zoom website. Login into the QBag portal by using the credentials that you must have already obtained from us. When you log in successfully, you will see a home page. Scroll to the end of this home page and locate the configure Zoom meeting button. Click to open it, the settings page of the portal that will open. The first setting shows your server name in red color. This item is to be used in the first text box on the start meeting software. It is also to be used on the first text box of the join meeting software. You will have to ask your participants to use this server name in the first text box of the meeting software as you are seeing here. This is important. Your customers, your participants have to enter this server in the first text box. And the next two items are for the Zoom meeting ID and Zoom meeting password. You have to enter the same values as shown in the meeting page of your Zoom account on the Zoom website. We have already explained that in a previous video. These items must be entered as one continuous string. Spaces are not allowed. Do not use spaces or hyphens even if you see them on the Zoom meeting page. The hyphens and spaces are not allowed. Type them in a continuous single string manner. And after that you can finish the other self-explanatory settings as per your preferences. You can select the allowed type of devices and whether to publicly show user login IDs. You can read all that. I'll close it right now. Thank you.